series. <laughs> yeah. Hey, it's Savannah and Kudzi, and in this series, we will be meeting some of the students working on UBC design teams, the projects they work on, and the spaces they occupy. We, we hope, hope you enjoy, enjoy the, the video. video. Oh yeah, I'm Sav. I'm actually on the uh, Furman Electric team here at UBC. Oh, that's super cool. Where are we right now? We're in the Engineering Design Center. So this building is just dedicated to all the different design teams that we have here at UBC, and it just provides like a dedicated space for them to work at um, and just work on all their projects. Do you want to see around? Yeah, that'd be awesome. Thanks. Let's go. What does Formula Electric do? Uh, well, we basically build um, electric uh, race cars that we then take to competition and we just see like how well we do compared to other teams on just various tests and various like races. Oh, that's awesome. What specifically do you do on the team? I'm part of the electrical sub team, so we design all the PCB boards that make the car actually uh, just like run and just, just like do all the things that we want to do. It's not just like a kind of metal. I think that's like a pretty useful functionality. So you said you're on the electrical sub team. Are there other sub teams uh, on Formula Electric? Yeah. Well, there's um, a hardware team, um, the, the, just like a mechanical hardware team that works on all the uh, just just designing the actual look of the car, and uh, then tries to just reproduce that in reality. So just like basically all the physical things that you see, um, that's that's what they do. And then the electrical team just, just fills in the work with all the like just the wiring and the PCB boards. We have a couple programmers as well that um, just program the boards and make sure that they function the way that we want them to. But in addition to that, we also have uh, just more like um, I guess like marketing and fundraising oriented teams as well. We need to recruit new members uh, to be part of our team, and we also need people to fundraise and find sponsors because well these cars aren't cheap. So awesome. Do you have a favorite memory associated with being on Formula Electric? Well, definitely the favorite memory I would say is just seeing the car up and running and just seeing uh, just different people uh, test drive the actual car. It's very rewarding to see all the work that you put into the car actually amount to something and just you know, seeing all the different systems work together and everything working the way it's intended to work. It's very rewarding. Yeah, it seems like you're super passionate about this. Thank you. Is there anything that you'd like high school students to know about your team? For sure. I'd say the like most important thing to know is that you don't really need to have that much engineering skills uh, when you're just going into one of these design teams. That's that seems to be like the most common misconception and why people why like people don't join teams in the first place. But in reality, you learn a bunch of this stuff when you actually start working on the actual project like itself, whatever that is. And there's a lot of experienced members on the design team help you um, just like pick up the necessary knowledge. So I, would, I wouldn't say that, um, like, I wouldn't let that be an obstacle for you to join a design team. Well, um, I gotta get back to work on my um, break light module that I'm working on, but it was nice talking to you. Yeah, you too. Thanks for showing us around. Yeah, no worries. <laughs> he really beat that cone. Oh, he's killing the cones now. 